Hi, eighth grade. Today we're going to look at a mentor text for an expository essay. This is a pretty good example of what you guys should be aiming for. I know that you've talked about expository essays and expository writing in previous grades, but we're going to do a refresher and we're going to improve our skills even further this year. So before we start anything, I want to do a quick review of the different sentence types in an expository paragraph, and we're going to practice identifying them. I'm going to do a section of it with you together, and then in the next slide, I'm going to have you practice it by yourself individually. So let's get started. So if you'll see up here in the left-hand corner, you'll see um, the different um, color guides for the different types of sentences in an expository essay. So I have the thesis as a aqua teal color, topic sentence is pink, example is blue, explanation is green, and yellow is concluding sentence. So we are going to start reading. The line between work and play is defined since we're young. Although both are important, some only make time for one. It is important to make time for both work and play because if you don't, you may have regrets someday on your well-being uh, or your well-being will suffer. So I would say that this section is your thesis statement, um, especially that last part. Um, you could maybe argue that that first sentence um, is a topic sentence, um, but we're going to lump it in all together since it's leading up to it. Um, so it is important uh, to make time for both work and play because if you don't, you may have regrets someday or your well-being will suffer. So it looks like these are going to be our two paragraphs. We'll read this first one together. Many people during the later years of their life will reflect on what they could have done differently. This is seen in the movie Click. Adam, in his younger years, works day, night, claiming that one day he'll be able to retire and have a lot of money. He spends so much time invested in his job trying to get promoted. He never finishes his kid's treehouse. He doesn't go camping with his family and misses many more important events. Before he realizes it, he's 60 and never spent any quality time with his family. He never made time to have fun. Adam spent all of his time working. He didn't realize his whole life had left him behind. All right, so topic sentence, you know, this is the order that they usually come in um, up here in the color key. So we'll look and see if it holds true for this one. So many people during the later years of their life will reflect on what they could have done differently. So this is an opening. Um, it's connected back um, to the work and life balance up here. So topic sentence is pink. This is seen in the movie Click. All right, so they're giving us an example. Good, it's a good sign. Example is blue. And then explanation, if you all remember from last year, um, the explanation should be the longest part of your expository paragraph. It should explain this example further in depth. So um, it talks about the movie Click and gives us a brief overview of it. So this is all still explanation. All right, that is green. And then the last sentence says, Adam spent all his time working. He didn't realize his whole life had left him behind. So it ties the movie with Adam and it ties it back to the idea that, you know, in the thesis statement that if you don't, you may have regrets. So it comes back. Um, so that would be our concluding sentence. All right, so I'm going to have you practice this in the next slide with paragraph two, identifying each sentence type, and then we'll come back together and talk about it further.